Sunderland Glass Centre is preparing for one of its busiest holidays this year. SR News talked to Sarah Harrison about what's in store this Easter. The National Glass Centre opened in 1998. It was opened by Prince Charles. Um, since then, we've we've been the main kind of arts cultural venue in Sunderland mm -hmm. um, that celebrates the history of glass making in Sunderland. So, um, our job is to kind of spread the word of how glass making really built Sunderland, um, mm -hmm. and it was a it was such a successful industry. Mm -hmm. um, since the industry's kind of fallen away, um, unfortunately, we're here to promote glass making and the art of studio glass making. Mm -hmm. we, we always have a really busy time over uh, school holidays. Mm -hmm. so the next big thing on our calendar is Easter holidays, um, and we're doing um, a lot of family activities mm -hmm. during that time. We are getting, we're becoming really successful with young families since we relaunched about a year and a half ago. We've increased our activities for families, arts and crafts activities, um, by about 100%. There is something for everyone at the Glass Centre this Easter. Look out for the Clarity Exhibition, Digital Storytelling Exhibition, the Glass Blowing Demonstrations, Easter Glass Painting, Easter Sunday Lunch and a Thousand and One Seeds to make a mini greenhouse. This is SR News reporting from the Sunderland Glass Centre.